They came from all corners of the country. More than 10,000 young Canadians here to remember. It's my great grandfather. He was injured here. Oh. You know? It just means a lot to me. They remembered, but also they tried to understand the costly, bloody battle. Walking in, just seeing the holes in the ground, and it's just unbelievable what what happened here so long ago. And uh, to know that men around my age went, um, it's just, it's amazing to know that they, they put their, their lives forward for the country. On this important anniversary, some felt a duty to represent their country. I find that I have much of a greater sense of pride to be a Canadian because I can see the, like how much effort these people have put into um, Canada and how much that they cared about the freedom of Canada and aspired to become greater and do greater things for my country. There it is. Others tried to make a connection with an ancestor. I saw the battlefields as they were. And that kind of made me feel like, like I was really here. And I can kind of feel them walking with me. It's, uh, it's really something, actually. Really uh, breathtaking. I can imagine it like in mud and people running through and just like the explosions and everything. I can just imagine it. And it would be truly awful to hear. I think people really underestimate youth. What we're doing here is we're developing citizens and we're growing their character. And letting them be part of something so big as today is going to remain forever ingrained within them. For the young people here, this has been a school trip that in many ways has taken them back in time, feeding a curiosity about an historic battle and proving that the legacy of Vimy still lives on. Tom Murphy, CBC News, Vimy Ridge.